The Cool Bean by Jory John. Watch out! Here come the Cool Beans. The, the cool, cool Beans. Oh yeah, check out how they move. Look at the way they swagger. Notice their sunglasses. Yow! It seemed like there were two types of beans in the world. There were the cool beans and the beans like me. I was in the cafeteria one day and I dropped my lunch on my loafers. But then something sort of miraculous happened. Out of nowhere, one of the cool beans helped me clean it up. She didn't even say anything. She just gave me a nod. That was it. Later, I was out on the playground. I tripped and scraped my knee. And maybe I cried a little and everybody saw it. Another one of the cool beans came by my side. And without a word, he dusted me off. That afternoon, I was sitting in class. I wasn't really paying attention. I didn't notice, but our teacher had called on me. Everybody stared. I sat there in silence. Nobody said anything. And then everybody just laughed at me. That was it. After today, I was officially a has-been. But then one of the cool beans stood up and came over to me. Everybody watched. She leaned in close and whispered, Hey, the teacher asked you to read from page 32. <gasps> then she gave me a quick wink and went back to her seat. It was a small gesture, sure, but it was also everything. That day made all the difference. It was a day that I could have been, it could have been really bad, if not for the kindness of a few cool beans. It gave me a shred of confidence. That shred of confidence has continued to grow. Somebody had my back, or a few somebodies. Throughout all of this, I realized it's not about how you look or any of that other silly stuff. It's about a wink or a nod or a smile at just the right moment. It's about dusting somebody off and helping them up again, pointing them in the right direction. <gasps> Do you need a hand? Yes, please. <gasps> now that's cool. cool.